Peace be upon you all. My name is Mr. Abdo from Mustafa Language Institute, Arabic Department, Cairo Zone. Today, inshallah, we will complete uh, Unit 10, Lesson 3 and 4. And let's learn some new adjective. Repeat after me. Hungry. 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 Nervous. 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 Tired. Tired. Tired, sad, 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 happy, 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 embarrassed, embarrassed, cold, cold, disappointed, disappointed, hot, hot, proud of, proud of. Now, we will take the first conditional clause with F. The first conditional clause with F, it expresses that something will be happy, will be happen in the future. The form is F, present simple, F, present simple, subject, future simple, present simple, he or she or it we put the verb at the end of the verb s or es or i e s but if i we you they we put the verb in the infinitive okay and the future symbol will plus infinitive. Will plus infinitive. For example, if he gets up early, he will be happy. If he gets up early, he will be happy. He will be proud if he wins a prize. If he wins a prize. He will be happy, uh, or will be proud, sorry, if he wins a prize. Will, and the abbreviation is Let's take some new exercises. Number one. So, or if, or who, I forget my homework, I will be nervous. If I forget my homework, I will be nervous. Forget is the present symbol. And will be is the future symbol. If you take off your jacket, you will be cold. If you take off your jacket, you will be cold. If she forgets or forget or forgot her homework, she will be nervous. If she forgets because he or she or it, put at the end of the verb S or ES or I, ES. Number four, if he fall, feel, falls off his chair, he will be embarrassed. Falls. Circle the old one out and replace it. Number one, nervous, proud, tired, drink. It's drink. And I will put hungry. Number two, when, made, get, lose. It's made. Because when and get and lose is the present symbol and made is the past symbol. Made. In, on, off, disappointed. At. Where, do, why, how, it's do. And I will put when. And the other questions is your homework. Let's complete. To start lesson four.
and we will read and the reading today is the history of TV this website is for TV fans do you like TV how much do you know about the history of the TV read this and find out in 1939 the first televisions go on sale in 1950 sorry in 1956 the first televisions were with remote control go on sale in 1960 public broadcasting begins in Egypt it is in black and white in 1969 720 million people watch Neil Armstrong walk on the moon in 1975, color broadcasting begins in Egypt. In 1998, the first Egyptian satellite, Nile Sat, will launch it. Let's return to the sheet. Let's learn some new vocabs. Website. Website, find out, find out, public, public, begin, begin, satellite, satellite, Egyptian, Egyptian, remote control, remote control, launch, launch, history, history, invent, invent, video games, Video games, percent, percent, internet, internet, TV fans, TV fans, go on sale, go on sale, broadcasting, broadcasting, electric computer, electric computer, million, million, no about, no about. Choose the correct answer. We are going to skip or forget or forgot a new satellite well in next month. We are going to skip a new satellite next month. TV plays fans satellite like watching TV. TV fans like watching TV. Read this paper and find out the information. In 1960, public broadcasting began in Egypt. Public broadcasting began in Egypt. And the other question is your homework. Thanks for listening to me. See you in the next time, inshallah.